My girlfriend ditched me for her sister on our special anniversary plans. My girlfriend, 24F, and I, 24M, have been together for a little over two years now and we live in the same townhouse complex. We are each other's first relationship and she absolutely means the world to me. I love her beyond words, and she's the most kind and caring person I've ever met. We're the kind of couple who observes our monthly anniversaries just as much as our yearly ones. Growing up, we both witnessed not the best examples of relationships in our respective families and we strive to break the pattern and do better together with our relationship. For our second anniversary, the plan was to have dinner at a nice restaurant where we had our first date. What my girlfriend didn't know was that while at dinner I was going to read her a poem I wrote about how much she means to me, our relationship, and how it'll always be her. This was going to lead into me proposing. Well, the dinner never happened because my girlfriend ditched me on our way to the restaurant. Some backstory. My girlfriend has two older sisters, 27F and 25F. They've always been close from childhood. When one of them is going through something then they're there for each other. This never bothered me, and usually it never affected our relationship in a major way until now. As we were preparing to head out, the middle sister called my girlfriend to say the oldest had a fight with her ex and was having a bad night. This upset my girlfriend and she was ready to avert our plans to help. But the middle sister insisted that she could handle it and that my girlfriend should still keep our anniversary plans. My girlfriend relented and after giving her some reassurances of my own, we went on our way to the restaurant. During the drive, it was clear that my girlfriend was no longer present. Suddenly she said she couldn't focus on anything else right now, and that she's just worried. I tried to reassure her again and remind her that the other sister was there for the oldest, but she was only getting more anxious and said she was worried the middle sister might get overwhelmed on her own. She asked to reschedule our plans, so I could drop her off at the older sister's place. I didn't know what to say. She clearly wanted to be elsewhere and I certainly wasn't going to make her choose between me and her sister, so I just drove her to the sister's apartment. She thanked me for being understanding, and said she'd call me later that night. Honestly, I was deeply hurt and feeling rejected. I understand that her older sister has been going through a rough time, but the middle sister, who insisted that she had it covered and that my girlfriend should keep our plans, was going to be there already for support. My girlfriend didn't have to go immediately. It wouldn't have bothered me on another occasion, but this was different. Later that night, we were FaceTiming and I confessed that I was disappointed we didn't spend our anniversary together. She said the situation was completely unexpected and that as an only child, I couldn't understand. Yesterday, she asked if we could have our rescheduled anniversary on Friday, but I told her she should ask her older sister for permission first before making plans. It was silent for a few moments, and then she said that was just being mean. She walked back to her house and hasn't really spoken to me since. I'm seeking advice on how to proceed from here. How do I salvage the relationship and for us to be able to move forward on a better path together? Edit number one. Hi, everyone. I posted this during my lunch break earlier and am just now seeing the comments. I'm in the process of replying now, so please bear with me. I did want to make this edit to address a frequent question popping up right arrow yes. Marriage is something my girlfriend and I have seriously been discussing since last December. Age hasn't been a deterrent for us. In each of our conversations regarding marriage she always said that she was 100% sure of us. Edit number 2. Another frequent question is about our monthly anniversaries right arrow I should have probably clarified this some more originally in the post. Our monthly anniversaries are usually smaller affairs. We always order cupcakes from a local bakery that my girlfriend loves. It could also be something like us having a movie night. The yearly anniversaries are more when the bigger plans happen such as going out to dinner or going on a staycation. Observing the monthly anniversaries was initially something my girlfriend brought up and I really liked the idea of it. Anniversaries are a big deal for us both. In my household growing up, my dad treated his anniversary with my mom like it was nothing and I saw how much that completely devastated her, and something she doesn't even know to this day is that I would hear her crying, alone while she thought I was sleeping. Seeing that year after year had a big impact on me and set my view a certain way. My girlfriend has a similar view to anniversaries as well from her own personal experiences. Too long did not read. My girlfriend of two years who I was going to propose to abandoned our anniversary plans, so she could be with her older sister for a non-emergency situation. I got caught in my feelings and blow off her attempt at rescheduling our plans. Now she's not really talking to me. Have you actually discussed marriage? Op.
neither you nor your girlfriend are ready or mature enough for marriage. And how would you know that what her older sister was going through was no more than one sister could handle? How do you know that there wasn't an abusive situation with the ex? You assert that your month anniversary date, like every month since you two started being in a relationship, was more important than the sister situation. But how do you know that? Then you go and act like a whiny sullen teenager to your girlfriend. You sound too clingy. You need to get more mature before you posture to propose, bro. The title of your post is wrong. It was not our special anniversary plans, they were your special anniversary plans. She did not know you were going to propose, and as you mentioned, you celebrate monthly anniversaries as well as yearly anniversaries. It's understandable that you were upset because your plans were thwarted, but she had no idea that was going to happen. You should absolutely apologize and I hope that you guys have had conversations around getting engaged so that this wouldn't come out of nowhere. I'm just here to see the obvious gender bias play out. She didn't ditch you. She was concerned about her sister and couldn't focus and asked you. It seemed to her an emotional emergency and you seemed to lack understanding. I'm in agreement with your GF. You acted very petty in your response. It seems you're being quite selfish and focused on your proposal instead of her. You sound a little selfish. How would she remember this proposal if she was so distracted by her sister's problems? And then your petty comment didn't help. Work this shit out before you propose, and be more flexible. She didn't know you were going to propose that night but wouldn't you rather it be a happy memory for her and not just you? How are you planning on proposing without telling her sisters? You are not her priority and you never will be. Get a refund on the ring and dump her ass.